This is a spoof. Yeah, walk this is jungle. a parody. This is a spoof. You know, this is what you do jungles. when you're waiting to take your January uh, RV trip to Courtside, Arizona to meet up with Robert yeah, Morales from Traveling Robert. So, watch at your own you, risk. This is a spoof, though. So much. See you guys. We can't help it. Pushing our way through. Pushing. Pushing. Going through. The trail is long and mighty. The natural environment is un otherworldly. You come across the ancient ruins of a lost civilization. <sighs> We've been on it for miles and miles and miles. Where is it? And we come across them. They're covered up in the rain. We covered them up. Who covered them up? The beauty, the beauty of it all. We take this path down this way. What do we come across? The whole colony, the whole colony of the beloved and sacred gopher holes. What will we encounter? We'll be back. More ancient ruins of a long lost civilization. Before our time, before the Earth saw its first humans, we'll go through this. A mound, a burial mound? What could these be? What could these be? But they're beautiful. We've been on this trail now for days, and we keep coming across these magnificent structures built by an ancient civilization. And what do we have up ahead? A body of water. The green algae. The lake so long ago, ago formed it sits it sits never to be touched by the humans what kind of monsters reside in there continuing down the, the trail we've been on it for hours upon hours we come across another colony another colony of rodents living shedding their fur what can be ahead? Where is this taking us? How many days do we have to traverse the hills and dales of this long forgotten land? Oh, it's amazing out here. More. Where are they from? How can they just live here? Up the hills, up the dales. Over and over, we traverse, and we walk, and we walk. What are we going to find? What are we going to find? The holes are covered. The holes are covered for why? The weather, the water. We'll be back. What is this? The eggs of those beasts sitting dormant for centuries waiting to be let loose on the, on the planet. The scourge of the world, waiting, waiting to hatch. Will we survive this trip? Only time will tell. The monsoons are blowing in on this trek through the high country, looking for those elusive animals that prey upon people. And we come upon, we come upon one. Run, you must run. If you stay too close to them, they may come up and get you. Let's take the walk. Let's take the walk into the wilds. We're coming along. Can't we see any more prairie? Any more ancient remnants of ground-dwelling animals? They're everywhere, folks. They're everywhere. Everywhere you look. We've been on this trail now for days. Hiking, hiking, hiking. What are these things? And then, oh my God, we're coming across. Monolithic buildings. Who built them? When were they built? The craftsmanship, how could they have stacked this all up? Oh my God, oh my God. Where have we come into? The land of the lost. The land of the unknown. Oh my God. 
gosh. Oh my God. And the, one of the first inventions of mankind, the wheel, lost into history. Let's follow it up. Let's see where it goes to. Oh my God. Look at the monolithic building style of the ancients. Of the ancients. Okay. There's some stairways here. ancient creatures all live. What could it be? Okay. Again, passing through a jungle. Oh, it's been days. Days and days of walking. Endless walking. Oh, what kind of, what kind of vegetation is this? Down the path. Down the path we go. We've all heard about these creatures from the deep lurking, lurking. Oblivion. Where do we go from here? Oh my god. Oh my god. What lurks? What lurks in these holes? Are they carnivorous? So they come out and get us. Oh no. Oh, I think we could have done that. Oh my god. This ancient mound. What lives in here? What are these? Oh, oh. There's a whole colony of them. Whole oh, colony. Oh, so happy we made this trek. Getting back down will be hard. But we are going to find these lurking animals. This ancient mound. What could be in here? What could be in here? Oh, look at the structures. Look at the structures. The ancients. The ancients built. What were they hiding from? What were they hiding from? And even under the most ordinary bushes, what do we find? Oh, the grand entryway into this maze of reptilians. Maybe the reptilians, the ancient astronauts, live down there. Run! Okay, let's go back down the trail. Oh, there's more. Oh my gosh, more and more of them. Colony after colony, yet none to be found. Just keep coming. All right. We'll be back. We must return. We must return to the city. Oh, it's been a blast. Another four-day hike out. I'll be able to edit this and put it together. Down the trail we go. Down and down. Back to the ancient vegetation. Unknown. Yet growing. We will talk to you in a bit. P.S. God bless America. Back along the monolithic ru ruins of a time forgotten, time long ago. There it is. There it is, stocking it. On the monument on top of the mountain. We've been waiting weeks and weeks for this. There it is, the elusive squirrel, the scourge, the demise of humanity. Yes, there he is. What are we going to do with him? It took me weeks and weeks and weeks to find this critter, the critter that lives beneath the mound. This is not a reptilian. It's not an ancient alien. It's a squirrel. What do we have over here?
The scourge of the West. The top the monument. The top of the mound. Let's see. Okay. Pushing through the bushes. There it goes. There they are. The dreaded creatures hounding us, stalking us. Into their holes they go. We found them. Days and days of hiking. We found the tunnels. And there they are. I have to stay behind the bushes. If they see me, they'll come after me. We'll be dead. Get back. Get back, I say. There it is. He feels my presence. Ancient Mound, Squirrel Mountain, and the top Squirrel Mountain is a monument built eons and eons ago. So there we have it, folks. We found it. And they retreated. They could be behind me. I gotta go. Thanks for watching. The Lost RVers.